In today's video, we're going to check out the WordPress Download Manager plugin and see what it's all about. WordPress Download Manager is a file management plugin you can use to manage, track, and control file downloads from your WordPress website. It allows you to enable passwords, utilize user roles, block bots and spammers, put downloads behind a paywall, as well as many other features. So let's go ahead and check it out. First things first, install and activate the plugin. Once that's done, you should see the download menu item added to your sidebar. This area will effectively be your dashboard for the plugin and the management of your downloads. When you press the add new button, a familiar looking screen will appear. You use the text area for a description of the download and the title is, well, the name of the download. Creating a new download using the plugin is actually very easy. In the upper right corner of the screen, you'll see a box labeled attach file. You can only attach a single file per new download page, though it can be a zip. If you are using a cloud storage service like Dropbox or Google Drive, you can use the URL tab to link it there. Under the package settings box, you have three tabs. The first labeled package settings is straightforward. You can set the details for the file that the users will see. Anchor text, versioning, who can access it, etc. You can then use the drop down for page template to choose how you want the download page to appear. The lock options tab holds the setting for how you want to restrict the plugin. You can add terms, password, or recaptcha to the page that must be completed or accepted before the download will begin. The icons tab is just as straightforward. You have a library of icons to represent what your customers will be downloading. Additionally, there's a link at the bottom of the tab that you can click to activate your site as a digital store. If you choose to activate this and sell your products, a new tab will appear upon page refresh called pricing and discounts. You have the option to set prices for your downloads and give discounts based on price, percentage, or even user roles. When you publish the download, a new page will be created where you can view it. The URL will be example.com slash download slash title of download. The content of the page is based on what you entered into the settings tab for that particular download. If you don't want to link to the page itself, but rather include the table and download button in a separate post, you can actually go into the old downloads page in your admin dashboard, and you'll see a short code column where you can copy and paste it anywhere on your site. If you want more options than just the base plugin gives you, you're in luck. The developers have a massive database of add-ons for you to choose from, including 15 free ones that extend the functionality well beyond this baseline. And there you go. That is everything you need to know about the WordPress Download Manager plugin. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.